construction crews have mainly been focusing on this set of parking lots and the front of the community. These metal plates are covering up several holes that they've dug up to replace this failing water distribution system. We've already had a week of construction. How has it been so far for you? Oh, I'm happy, but I hope they finish soon. Carmelita Polito is 75 years old. I last spoke with her two weeks ago before construction began. Now, this is what her back patio and parking lot looks like. Because I can park, plus there's a lot of us, and they lock my back gate. Her parking lot was previously blocked by a sinkhole for over a month, but now she can't access that area due to the construction. Put this thing, see? Right. So I to block you from, from falling in or going in. But there are changes coming to construction. According to a City of Henderson letter given to residents Thursday, the contractors, Triple J Trenching, found that the underground materials were different than they expected, which will now lead to more water shutoffs. Here's a breakdown of the changes. Full complex water shutoffs will happen when new water main valves are installed. That'll last two hours at a time. But residents can expect up to eight hours of water shutoffs when contractors start connecting water lines. This will only happen during construction hours of 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. Monday through Friday. Are no, you concerned with additional that's issues? That's the most number one concern because, you know, we're fixed income. The city originally estimated a $400,000 to $600,000 price tag for the replacement three weeks ago, but never gave me a current estimate when the construction plan was announced. The HOA management company Camco said that the cheapest replacement plan they found was $1.4 million. So there's no clear answer on the cost and it'll have to be paid back through a tax lien on each property. That's why I said, no, please, please, you know, be kind to us. As for now, the project is still expected to last a total of 45 days. That means eight more weeks of construction. The city says the cost and timeline of the project could change depending on the work that needs to be done. I will continue to reach out to the city for more answers. Reporting from Somerset Park, I'm Ryan Ketchum.